I think he might be as stuck as they get. <sighs> feels great, actually. I was gonna say feels bad, but it doesn't feel bad at all in the slightest. Alrighty, hey, what's going on guys? It is Lachlan here and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Ark Survival Server. So if you guys happened to miss the last episode, there was a uh, unfortunate uh, circumstance with the uh, the weather and it uh, killed me when I went into the snow. But that is fine, we're back again and we actually ended the last episode with a Binosaurus here knocked out. But the problem is, is that his torpor is rapidly decreasing. Now, we lost our first one this way. Uh, if you guys remember, he actually just woke up in the middle of it, and it was really depressing. So we're going to go ahead and uh, make sure this one does not do the same by just feeding him an absolute crap ton of narco berries. Uh, now, the other way I want to try and do this is to try and get some type of uh, way to get some prime meat. Now, there was a saber tooth over here, and I'm hoping that the saber tooth will drop some prime meat, but I am more scared about its torpor than anything. I think it can accidentally knock itself out. Um, well, not knock itself out, and unknock itself out, if anything. Uh, oh, we know what that means, guys. <gasps> Holy fuck, it's an alpha raptor, alpha T-Rex. Holy shit, fuck that. Um, I've got 63 stone arrows, though, so if we could try and kill that bad boy, I would be down. Um, and of course, the way we would do that is just try and wedge him so that he can't get to us. He's only eaten one piece of meat, that guy. Um, oh, I'd actually... I'm actually quite, quite intrigued about this Alpha T-Rex. There are some rocks I can work with. All right, that would be interesting. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and spend most of my time just getting a bunch of narco berries and then hopefully coming back and making sure that, that guy doesn't wake up like he did the first time we tried to tame a spine. If you remember that, that was pretty hilarious. Okay, we have a uh, we have a problem. We have a scorpion who thinks he is the bee's knees. Bad. You're going to knock yourself out, aren't you? You're going to knock yourself out. You, your poison's going to hit you, and you are just going to knock out, eh? Torpor, it's going in. Oh, his torpor level's very high, though. Um, I'm more scared. I wish I used that scorpion on the friggin' bird that's sitting there. I mean, the bird. That, oh, no, that, that alpha... That's alpha carnor, actually. Carnor. We're in a bad situation, guys. We can't actually kill this bad boy. New objective. I need to get into here. I need to get here. I just, if I aggro that Carno, it's going to be a real bad situation for everyone involved. Oh, this guy's going to wake up regardless, I think. I don't think I can kill this guy. Uh, I don't think I can wake this guy up, guys. I think he's just going to die. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I'm going to kill him anyway. He's, I can't tame him, so I'm going to kill him. I know it's a very shameful act, but I have to do it. All right. Let's get the real prime meat. I hope that didn't attract the alpha. Okay, we didn't. Yeah, I'm sorry, I don't have the narcotics available to actually do that, or the prime meat. Um, so, yeah, it had to do what had to be done. You, on the other hand, I'm going to probably peek him for some food. Uh, yes, you were. Uh, so I'm going to leave you with all of the raw prime meat, buddy. And I'm going to give you some of that as well. Uh, now, I want to try and kill this guy. So I'm going to make a smithy and all the other stuff that I need to make to try and get this going. Uh, I'm going to get you guys to... Follow me. Can we get a, or follow all, please? I want to bring him closer to the this side of the jungle so that he doesn't attract the other uh, Alpha Kano. There's a bird on the window there. That's actually kind of annoying. But we're going to need a good setup to try and kill this bad boy. So that's what we're going to spend the next couple of minutes doing here. So let's get, uh, what was it? Uh, what are we going to need now? Let's make the smithy. We're going to need uh, ironing. It's correct. Metaling, it's five. That's not too bad. We're going to need a refining forge. So let's go ahead. And for that, we're going to need wood, flint, hide. More hide, actually, is probably the only hard thing immediately to get. Um, but everything else should be just fine. So there's the thatch we're probably going to need. I'm uh, going to need a little bit of wood out of this bad boy. So let's grab that. And that's that. Oh, hello. You are going to be my source of um, source of hide. And it's, uh, it's this for the hide. So, yep, that's enough hide. That's enough hide. Okay, how much more do we need for this forge? We need some flint. I think that's about it. Flint and stone. Oh, we need a lot of stone. Okay, let's literally just sit here until we get that. Plus, we're getting metal that we need as well. Uh, there's the flint, and let's get the stone. Oh, there's a lot of stone we be needing. Oh, there is a lot of it. Okay, where is more stone? Is this stone? That's that's still breaking. That's that's broken stone. Doesn't count just as much. All right, this one's just got stone, so that's perfect. We're gonna be, not be able to move soon, so. That's going to happen. Uh, forge, how far are we off? We're off 25. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to drop the stone here. And I'm going to whack it like that. That's enough. Grab that. And let's craft ourselves 
this forge. Next up, we're going to need to get those metal going in the smithy. So I'm going to start hitting some more rocks or that stuff as well. Alrighty, and use item. I have to, oh, I have to make a foundation for it. There's so much stuff that has to go into this. So what's the easiest foundation I can make? I actually make a thatch one right now, so that's perfect. So much stuff that has to go into this, man. It's so annoying. All right, here we go. Let's get this foundation, use item, and put it down. Okay, and then at the same time, gonna need to go ahead, inventory, and place this down on top. We need enough space so we can put the smithing down as well. Alrighty, perfect. And let's start smithing some uh, some metal that we have right here. So we got some wood as well to work with. Yeah, we do. Let's always keep it lit, always keep it working on stuff. So let's go ahead, grab some metal, please. Metal, metal, metal. Uh-huh. We need five pieces of metal, and then we need metal to actually repair the thing as well. So this is going to be quite hard, I think. Uh, and also making sure to keep dropping our flint that we don't need, and more importantly, the stone that we don't need. So yeah, 64 should definitely take down this Kano. Why aren't we getting any metal? I wish there was some metal rich rocks in here. Come on, metal, all we care about. One metal. Why no metals? All right, so that should hopefully be enough metal. Let's have a look at what we need to craft the rest of the smithy here on the fly. Gonna need the five metal ingots, 50 of the stone, which I already have, and the wood and the hide. All right, so, um, I think that should all be pretty much good to get. Uh, I'll just have to wait for those five metal ingots for the most part. Um, I'm getting hot right now sitting next to this thing, which makes sense. Uh, two metal ingots. All right, let's just get those other things. There's stone right here. That's all I need. There's 30 stone. I think that's all I need from it. Isn't that right? No, we need more stone, wood, and hide. Hide. Let's try and hunt down some hide while we wait. All righty. Where is a place a man could get some hide? I'm starving, actually, and I'm freezing. Hopefully, I can kill this guy real quick. All right, he's only level four. No, he's fast, though. He's fast as fudge, actually. Oh, he's, oh, he's, he's run right into a wall. He's, uh, he's, he's not very smart. <laughs> he's not very smart as well, at all, at all, at all. All right, and there's the hide, and for good reason as well. We got a bunch of that stuff. Now, I need to get some wood as well. So, I'm just thinking, like, two chops in, like, 50. There we go. And just a couple more hits on the stone, and we should be good to go. We went from hot to ice cold. Literally ice cold. And I can still see that Alpha Kano. He's actually on this side of the river now. He's getting closer and closer. I gotta watch that. All right, there's all that stuff. Let's check the smithy. Gonna need, uh, there's 20 pieces of stone to make this. So there we go. There's the stone. Let's get the head and make that smithy. Craft that bad boy. Get ready to plop it right down next to us on the other side. Wow, I can't believe I've gone through all this effort just to try and kill this thing. And all I needed was repair the crossbow. Alright, perfect. Access inventory. And now comes the fun part of trying to repair this bad boy. So to repair it, we're going to need four metal ingots, some fiber, and some wood, was it, I think? Yep, and some wood. So, let's get things started with the wood. The fiber, and all we need now is four of your finest metal ingots. Stop putting out the fire, Lachlan. Two more, and we're actually going to need some more metal. So, Lithopotamus, let's get some metals. And of course, because I need it the most right now, we're getting barely any of it. There's two. I love when the birds try to fight me. It's just like, yeah, let's fight, dude. I'll fight you. You want to fight? Sure you want to fight about that? Now you're sure? And they're just not that sure in the end of it, because they end up dying all the time. Uh, what has he got in his inventory? Sure, let's have a look. Argantifus tails. I actually need those for what's his face. So I will gladly, gladly take those and hopefully that other stuff has successfully um, done its job or I'm going to be in a lot of trouble here in a second. In a hot second, I'm going to be in a lot of trouble. So I'm going to fly Mega Aerodactyl. I'm going to look for some vantage points in a second. But I think that was the last of what I need to actually repair this. If I put four metal ingots in, it should let me repair the dang thing. And there we go. All that effort. All of that effort, and now we have our crossbow back. Okay, let's look for some vantage points and leave him here. I'm gonna set you to uh, neutral, buddy, so you can fight whoever you want when you want. And uh, let's try to get a vent. Let's. <laughs> oh, I'm joking on everything here. I'm gonna try and see if I can find a solid vantage point for this Carno. And uh, that's not good. I saw a Spino just topple right over it. I have to try and lead it to like over here, but there's a T-Rex over there, so preferably not there. Um. I'm gonna try and lead it down the river, actually. Yeah, so hey, hey dude, what's going on? Going on, you look stuck as fudge. I'm gonna sit here, and as soon as he moves, set passive, don't try to fight him. See if he moves. I think he might be as stuck as they get. Uh, feels, 
Feels great, actually. I was gonna say feels bad, but it doesn't feel bad at all in the slightest. Let's see how many arrows he takes. I gotta really... I'm just scared about that T-Rex on the left. And scared that at one point he might say, Wow, fudge this kid on getting free hits for days. I might go somewhere else. Because I know it's programmed that he'll start moving after a certain amount of times of getting hit. But if he's as stuck as they come and can't move, and he is testing out... Please don't try to get too adventurous here. Please, I beg actually, do not get adventurous. Okay, hopefully he's feeling this. He doesn't seem to be taking a huge amount of damage. I got one on his tail there. Please don't block headshots, buddy. Alrighty, it seems to work in a pretty similar rotation to his tail. Blocking his head, there we go. Uh, how many arrows will it take to kill you? Uh, a primal raptor would be dead by now. Uh, he's only, I didn't check his level actually. I don't want to check his level. Oh, 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 he's turning back around. That's my boy. Alrighty, stay that way please. I want to move here. I just want to kind of be behind this tree. Make sure I'm hitting him, though. Yep, de definitely hit him. Um, <laughs> so, some very uh, entertaining PvP here today. He's not dying, though. So, I can only imagine how painful an Alpha Raptor... Oh, sorry, an Alpha T-Rex would be. Because this guy is an Alpha Kano and is taking all of these arrows. And he doesn't even... I can't even... Oh, I'm actually starting to see some blood on him now. But nothing crazy. Um, I don't have any bullets for that shotgun, otherwise I'd be firing that thing right at its face. Uh, looks like he's got a little bit of blood on him. I don't want to check, though. Our guy Vantivus, if you switch the tanks, I will be very pissed at you. Oh, 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 he's nearly dead. He's nearly dead. You can see that blood for days. He is feeling the burn. He is like, wow, this guy is really good at the game he's playing. I must just sit here and let him finish me off. I can't believe this is half- I can't believe it's not butter first, but, like, he's just letting me just- Slap him around like this. Oh, I swear. I swear. I don't want to have to deal with what is going on down there. Really? He needs 11 more hits. I'm sorry. I don't, don't, go away. Come to go away, please. For crying out loud. I think Mega Aerodactyl is going to die. But I must kill this guy first. Come on, he's so close to being dead. Look how much blood is on him. Look at how much blood. Finally. Okay, come back here, buddy. Um, oh, no, you can fudge right off. You can fudge right off. That is my kill. He's actually trying to eat my kill here. This is disgusting. Yeah, that's what you get when you try to eat my kill. I'm very afraid of what's going up there, though. I won't get him back. He has to either beat that. I think he's set to passive. And he's just going to die. If I have to. I have to. I want to check this guy out first and try to harvest from him. Uh, what, it, what was in him? Let's check. Here we go. Tranquilizer arrows, stone arrows, a primitive crossbow, and a rockwell recipe. Are you kidding me? An alpha carno. I kill an alpha carno, and that's all I get. That's very disgusting. Oh, but that's... Is that a better type of chintin? Or oh, chitin, sorry. Oh my god, look at the pro means. Uh, yeah, it's ramshackle chitin. Okay. Not too bad, but still pissed off. All right, how many levels did I get for that? Uh, let's see. Uh, let's go melee movement, movement, health, and that's it. Three levels. Okay, now we got to try and rescue our friend up in the sky. Because if he dies, I'll be really pissed off. And plus, I'm still going to harvest all the prime meats from that guy. Hopefully bring them home. But I am very, very scared at the same time that uh, he's... Got, is that another primal? No, okay, good, that's my stuff. Yeah, can't believe it. First primal carno down for the series. And... Uh, Got us a spino. Uh, we would have been able to set that up much better, but I hope uh, Marigat Aerodactyl is not dead. And okay, it looks like he survived. All right, let's bring him back down and let's harvest some of these bad boys that we've got down here. Um, damn. All right, let's uh, let's start harvesting the primal Carno Taurus and uh, work our way from there. He just took so many hits to kill; it was actually insane. All right, this Dimorphodon thinks he's getting some of this. He can fudge right off. All right. Let's see here. I'm going to harvest him with an, uh, a pickaxe. Uh, yeah, let's do it with this. Uh, let's do it with this. Here we go. Let's dig for that meat. Oh, boys, look at that pro meat. Look at that prime meat. And 86. 86 of them. Okay. All right, so let's go for a bit of a U here. Stop, everybody. And Pidgeot, I want to go ahead and just chuck all these prime meats on you. Oh, when you dance all night and you just deserve so much prime, ripe, prime raw prime meat. It's actually insane. Let's go ahead, and now this is the bulk of it. This is the rest of it. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. How's that weight going on you? Your weight's fine. Oh, they don't weigh that much at all. Oh, they're starting to decompose my inventory. Uh-oh. Whoa. You get the chitin. Yeah, I'm sorry. You don't get the chitin. The chitin is mine, buddy. All right. The pro raw prime meat, though, that's all you. That's all you. And just like that, we can piece the scene. All right, so let's try to get home before all this stuff disappears. 
Also, I just realized that there was a bunch of metal over here that I could have grabbed earlier, but we don't care about that. But yeah, just counting, I think it took about 40 stone arrows, 40 to 50 stone arrows to the head to kill a Karno Primal. That's some scary stuff. Uh, I really hope it's not red. I can do everything but red right now. Uh, purple is 35. Looks purple. Okay, here, buddy. Here, buddy. Come here. Let's get some free purples. All right, that Ar Argy's catching up. He is the slower of the two, but uh, hopefully it won't impact everything too badly. Uh, just some pterodons, spinos, uh, T Rex, but that's fine. All right, he's following him and he's following each other. Oh, no, they've created a follow loop. No. No, I can't believe I've done this. No. Oh, no. We're, 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 we're fudged. We're actually fudged here. I can't believe I've done this. Oh, shit. Now I can't see them. Oh, that's just great. Okay, so I'm fucked. But on the second note, I'm going to get whatever the hell's in here. I'm going to run straight for that hill and try to parachute down and get them. This probably won't work, and I think I've just lost them in the dumbest way I could think fucking possible. But... Um, yeah, this feels fucking bad, man. Uh, I'm gonna get on top of that and try to go up here or micro for the mountain because I'm gonna go for the mountain because it's got higher things. But if I get like a T Rex to aggro me or something, I am completely fucked. Um, so this is gonna be very interesting, very interesting indeed. Supply crate 100 out of 100 here. Uh, can I, can I, can I get this shit, please? Like, oh, don't tell me that's one I can't get. It's purple as shit, dude. You tell me that's red and you can fuck right off because that is purple as they get. All right, and there we go, access inventory. A grenade, a motherfucking grenade. I can make that shit, all right? That's A's, all right. For f I've lost my birds over this. I can't believe this shit. Okay, I have to get up there. I don't even think, I think they're lost forever. I actually think they're dead set lost forever. I have to write this down and try to recover them later. It's gonna be A's. All right, I have to go into the forest and do what I said. The thing is, they spiral up and try to get on, uh, they try to get up on top of each other and then next minute, they're just at the high- Oh, you can fuck right off. Okay. You can fuck right off. Alright, he, he got the message the first time. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna have to go to the top here and parachute over. It's gonna be some edgy shit. I don't know. Because they're probably- I had to wait for that purple beacon. And they're probably climbing higher than I am right now. Um... I hope they're not, and I hope there's also a height limit. They're, and I hope it's the same as whatever the fuck this volcano is. Alright, this is, uh, I don't see them. Oh, is that them? No, that is a, uh, dirt on my screen. <laughs> I really hope they're not reaching faster than I'm reaching. Oh, we got some stim berries here. Clutch. Why can't I eat? This hill, this hill's so steep. I can't even get over it. That's amazing. Alright, I almost think we should let go and try to find these things. I need to buff the whistle range, man. That's such BS. As soon as it starts capping me out, I'm going for the jump here. Come on, get me up here. Yep, perfect. Okay. And then... Nope, nope, nope. But can we... Can we work hard here? Come on, a man's just trying to work hard. All right, here we go. Wish me luck. I don't see the birds. I should have probably gone higher up. You know what's funny? I think I see a primal over here as well. Yep, that is a primal. What is it? Is it a raptor? I can kill it in 23 hours. It's a raptor. It's a raptor. Okay, because we're going in straight for this guy, I'm gonna up the melee damage and uh, try and go for this right here. Uh, who knows how this can go. The birds, I'm gonna have to get a, a, a mount and try to get up there. Uh, but there's no rush to do that, I guess, because they're gonna be in perpetual motion for the next 20 minutes, so until they reach height limit, in which case we're fucked. Uh, but I need to find... Oh, what the fuck? Where did these come from? Oh shit, we're really low. Oh shit, we're really low. It's not every day you see four saber tooths running straight at you. All right, if I can try and position these in a way that I don't have to fuck like shoot them, that'd be lit. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Gotta love me some mate boosted sabers. Four of them exactly. All right, they're not that hard to kill. We're scared of their attack damage. All right, there's one down. Gotta watch our health here. I really need a pterodon right now to help carry me out of here as well. And get me my mounts back. And me oldest mount. Ugh. Oh, it's his, it's, it's, it's my bird. It's just his mount, I guess. Okay. He's attacking something for a while, actually. He's really going at it, but he's in a spot where I'm just shooting him to death. I hope I'm getting these shots on. I don't see how I can miss these shots. Okay, he's starting to move now. Okay, please do not find a way up here. Wait up. I'm gonna use this grenade. <laughs> let's see how good this grenade is. Let's, let's see this. This is gonna be bad. Alright. I really should not pursue this because this could go really south for me. Okay, I'm hoping there's a valley coming up in here. He's eluded me this far. I shall let him live. All right, Mr. Dodo. I don't know how you lived. Okay, so the hunt for a new pterodon begins. Uh, I, yeah, no, it has to be a pterodon. I have to go ride a pterodon up there, catch both of them, 
And, um, yeah. It's, it's gonna be sick. Alright, so this is near where we lost them. It's not too far away at all, I think. I think it's actually pretty much it. Um, but I found this pterodon across the river. Please do not get up and go anywhere. Please don't do that. It's so overrated. Just stay right there where you are. Please. Why? Why, why are you gonna move? Why, why did you have to do that? Like, why do you actually have to do that? That's kind of... Oh my, this would be the most... Em that would actually really suck if I died right now. Come on, come back down. Come back down. Yes, land, land, land. Perfect. Okay, come on now. We can do this. There's one. He's not moving. There's two. He's still not moving. Uh, I'm gonna tame two at the same time. See who's quicker. And I'm really bad. So, like, do you guys not, like, feel damage in this update or something? Like, <laughs> they just... I'm just like, oh, that's nothing. Oh, that's also nothing. All right, the, all right level nine will be easier to tame. Uh, yeah, like, I, I need a quick tame here, guys. Like, I can't... I, beggars cannot... Uh, actually, I can be a chooser here. But I just want the guy who tames the quickest and the fastest. So whoever... Which one of you guys want to do that? Just go ahead and decide between yourselves. You both get a packet of meat to both of you. Uh, I'm probably going to need some narco berries as well on top of that. But, um, yeah, I still got to fix my whole clusterfuck that I've, uh, made. I think it's actually down the river that way where it happened. But, yeah, it should be fun trying to find her, her things. Oh, wow, I'm actually, like, dying right now, so... And if I go near this, I'm gonna get even hotter, so I should really just grab my food and get the fudge out. Um, but, yeah, not too great right now. Not too great at all. Um, I don't know why I'm really losing health right now. Should I be gaining health? Uh, I'm going back up. Whew. Okay, so this pterodon's doing it quicker, and I probably will just invest in that one, honestly. Um, how's this one going? Yeah, he's, the other one's taking longer, and I only need one, so you can just wake up and do whatever you want when you wake up. But I'm gonna need to farm a lot of narco berries to make sure that guy doesn't wake up. And then I gotta work at making him his saddle as well. Alrighty. We have finally tamed our pterodon. I'm gonna go ahead and name him Please Work, and I hope this guy works really hard. We've already crafted the saddle here. Let's go ahead and let's find these mother fudgers. I can't believe, oh, and we're too fat, yay. Okay, I wonder how high they have gotten. And I gotta find exactly where they were on the map. Uh, I think it was around here. There was a, there's a spino here. There wasn't a spino here last time. I'm not sure if it was down this way or up that way. I'm trying to find the way I came up this place, and then try to backtrack from there. But straight up from that direction. Honestly, I think that might be the same beacon placement. Actually, this looks very similar right here, this little embankment. So if I think if I go straight up from around here, then uh, hopefully looking at money. Found him! Yay! What's up, guys? I guess they did actually stop going up at a certain point, and I think my parachute idea actually would have worked. Um, but it would have been a lot of patience. So. Uh, I guess I get a cool pterodon. That, that's cool. Um, you guys want to follow me, you absolute jags. Uh, if there was another command to get them down, I would be really pissed off. But, let's go back down. I'm going to switch the, uh, the flying, and we're going to go. Oh, that T-Rex is still going for that guy. Look how far away we are. I suppose it only take five hours to get home. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty guys, well on that note, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up today's episode of Ark right there. Hope you guys did go on to enjoy today's episode. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like rating down below. And hopefully I'll make it home in one piece with a, uh, a brand new pterodon as well. Guess it's a nice little bonus. Anyways guys, catch you next time. Later guys.